to complete and to calculate the angular motion. This is problem number two, physics. Okay, well, what is the problem? The wheel, can you see in the board? The wheel of a car spins at a 30 revolutions per minute. For five minutes, the diameter of the wheel is one meter. What is the angular speed of the wheel? What is the angular displacement of the wheel during this time period? And how far does the car travel in five minutes? How far does the car travel in five minutes? Car travel travels. Okay, because car is singular, then the verb must be less. Noun and verb agreement. Okay, maybe this is how far does the cover car travels? Not travel, right? It's a minor thing on me. Okay. Car travels in five minutes. Okay. Like that. Okay. So again, wheel as a circle. The tire of a car is a circle. Okay. And the, the rubber is black color, right? So, by the way, who discovered the vulcanization of rubber? A scientist who discovered the vulcanization of rubber, which is the the, the, the basis of all vulcanization process of anything. So he is Mr. Charles Goodyear, okay? Mr. Charles Goodyear, that's why we have a product of Goodyear of the wheel because it's dri driven by that before. He is a scientist before. Charles Goodyear discovered the vulcanization of rubber. So it's related to this, right? This is wheel or tire, okay? When it is flat, depressurized, then that's the time you will go under the vulcanization. Oh, diba? You have to do something to the leaking of the pressure, something like that. The air, so that you will cover that for something. That process is vulcanization, right? Okay, so this is going to be the wheel. It's going to be like, uh, we have, the wheel have the outside diameter and the inside diameter, just like uh, a pie. So we have the black here, right? The, the rubber or something like that, okay? So if you try to be straight, we have the inside diameter, Okay, inside diameter and the outside diameter. Okay, here. But in this particular topic, we are not concerned with the schedule, the type of the pipe. Sometimes schedule 30, schedule 25. That is only applicable for the metallic uh, material construction, but this is rubber. So we don't need to have to put schedule number 20, schedule number 10, because it differs also for the inside diameter and outside diameter. Okay, so I remember that in engineering class before. Something like that. So, uh, initial diameter, initial, inside diameter and outside diameter. Okay, now, here we have, what's that? Five minutes. It's not mentioned. Oh, mentioned. The diameter of the wheel is one meter. Meaning to see, guys, this is the diameter from the outside lining of the pile. Meaning this is the outside diameter, not the inside diameter. So it's here. Here up to here. Meaning outside DO, not DI. Because DI is another story. You have to put X here. X, the, this, the thickness of the inside diameter and the outside diameter, and you have to subtract. For example, if you have values of inside diameter and outside diameter, you have to subtract that. It will become the thickness. Something like that. So X is equals to D2 over D1. Kailangan niya sa mga equation sa kuan, sa katong insulation, uh, topic of heat transfer. You need to determine the thickness, but this is not insulation problem solving. I'm only telling to connect the situation, okay? Like that. Forget about that a little bit. At least we're, unless we're trying to say, compute the heat energy of the tire when it will become flat. Then at the time, we will put this X D2 minus D1. Because for the head transfer formula, right? Delta Q, delta T, delta T. Okay, but that is not the topic here. Okay? Get the point. So, mga siya, focus na sa centripetal force. So, first, what is the angular speed? Angular speed, katong ang naman. Oh, ganon. And then, what is the angular displacement? Ay, nakakal. Angular displacement is like this. We have chart. Okay? We have angular velocity times time. We have also uh, initial angular velocity times time plus one half angular acceleration 
nakakaloka. T squared. But your T here, mga talaga, omitad with the capital T. The reverse of your frequency. Take note. Be careful. The time here is not the normal small letter T na emerging is such a direct so. It's not. Because we have the T here is another thing. The reverse of frequency in this particular topic. This is angular motion. Take note. It, it will be wrong if you use the ordinary time to substitute here. Okay? Uh, angular displacement is also equal to ganun ganun chuba chuba chuba. Okay, na kung siya may ani na formula. Okay, one half angular initial velocity plus uh, final angular velocity times time. Ito ang capital P. Okay, na kung siya lagi. Ang ano lang siya istorya, istorya mo na po. Okay, we have, okay, the other one, the first. Okay, final velocity, no. Final angular velocity. Punta na ginagin mo kang angular ni kayaw yaw guys, ha? Okay. Final angular velocity and then initial angular velocity which is the plus 2 plus twice of your angular acceleration times your displacement. Oh, ganon. Okay. So, more than siya mga problems is mo. Or siya kang buko. One, four kang buko, guys. So, mapili din yung ka. Okay. Or later lang sa. Okay. And then, okay. How far does the car travel sa ganon? Chuba, chuba, chuba. So, how far is going to be the distance, right? Yes. Okay? So, talking about the distance, which is, bali na kung kaani, bali na kung kaani. Okay? Timorong kaya po na ang distance good sa displacement. Oh, okay. Ganoon. Here, mga kalangga, wala siya din siya ng time, but hindi siya lagi ang time ng happiness. Okay? You got the point? Ganoon. Okay. So, solve. So, Angular velocity is equals to 2 pi radian times the frequency. Okay, ganon. So, what is your frequency there in your joule? So, frequency, compute the yon. Okay. Ang um, frequency ni mo higa yun na is 30 revolution per minute. Okay, and nasa tayo po ang mo na 5 minutes. Ganon. So, i-multiply nyo mo siya yung the revolution. Okay. Five minutes. Okay. You have the revolution. Pilihan yung revolution. 150 rap revolution. Okay. We have done the revolution. This is not yet the per second, ha? Okay. Ano siya? Revolution. 150 revolution only. Meaning it's only the one cycle. Okay. This is not yet the, the two pi. Okay. Two pi meaning... <laughs> 360 degrees rotation. That's, that's equivalent for 2 pi. Okay? Now, so what are you 2 pi times radian over the revolution. Ganon. Okay? And now, the revolution is the same. Okay? So, 150 revolution. Okay? 150 revolution. Then, the unit ni mo ni higay is always magin radian per second. Tasa may ani kayo. Okay? Now, seconds man. Okay? Naman, 5 minutes. I-convert din mo ang 5 minutes into seconds. Okay? Kaya ka na, revolution pa man yun. This is still revolution. Revolution per second. So, ang 5 minutes convert that to seconds. So, 5 minutes. Um, 1 minute, 60 seconds. Oh, 300. Oh, right? 60 seconds. Oh, no. Wait, 60 seconds. Okay, 300 yun siya. 300 seconds. Okay, so cancel revolution, we have 2 pi red gradient seconds. How much? Ganon na kayang angular velocity. Okay, so, uh, ganon, chuba chuba chuba. 2, okay, mga palaga kong mutad. 2 times pi. Okay, nana siya. Then times 150 is equal to divided by 300. Mm. 3.14 na itong angular velocity. Angular velocity, ako nang pag sa space, at the top, at the top, at the top, is 3.14. 3.14, ang sama na siya, guys? 3.14, ano siya? Radian per second. So, this is now your angular speed. Then, agree, oh? Okay. Angular speed here, and angular velocity, is just the same in definition because we are not concerned with the direction. So, 
not relevant the direction here, not relevant the direction here. That's why the angular speed here is just equal to angular velocity. Okay? Get the point. We are not considering the direction here. Magnitude will be. Okay? Something like that. So, so your 2 by 2, 2. This is the wheel half. Ang imong diameter niya hindi yun na is ano ba yun? 1 meter. Atong pa 1 meter feet. Pwede sa sangok. Okay, 1 meter. O, ganun. This is your total na mga mga kung ano. The diameter is 1 meter siya. Okay. Yung mga yung timaan guys ha? The diameter of the wheel is 1 meter. Okay, that is not a radius. Okay? Ano na po? Di ko ito na po kaan na ron. Okay, so ganun yun. So, what is the angular space? Di ba pili? Ano ni? Ang sabi na pinakasayin na sa sotero. Okay. Go to number one. Sabi so, na kaya dito rin mo na kay angular speed and sa kay time na 300 seconds din ang sasuwayan mo. Theta is equals to uh, 3.14 radian seconds. Okay. Times uh, ganun siya 300 seconds. Okay. So, we need to say you have radian. Okay. Here. 3.14 times 300 942 942 radian ano ang angular displacement okay oh, 942 kaya nga naman ano siya what is the angular displacement of the wheel during this time period we need to say you will use this 5 minutes because during this time period English okay 740 uh, radian oh, ganon now, if you want to check really, then go for the others also, ha? Okay? If you want to... But take note the, the complexity of the quantities. For example, you will check numbers on. You will use number two. So we have initial velocity here. Okay? Angular, initial angular velocity. The wheel of car spins, blah, 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 so on. So nothing. Now, let's say we will assume this as zero. This one. Okay. One half. And do we have the angular... Do we have the angular acceleration? Diba? Lubog siya kaya may tapang kag-angular acceleration. Angular acceleration because the, the ganun, diba? Uh, A, angular acceleration times the R. Hmm. Nakaradius, wala yung problema na higayin na. But what you get acceleration? Okay, because your velocity here is not in meter per second, in radian per second. So, mulubog siya. You, you never use this one. Okay, ikatulo. One half of the final uh, angular velocity and initial velocity times time. Really? Pwede siya. Okay, pwede siya. Okay, pwede. Imo reverse ha? Kaming 330 revolution per minute. Pwede siya. Kami. Okay. Kung pwede ni siya, ang equation number 3, be sure your dis angular displacement will be equal also to this angular displacement. And if it is equal enough, there's no need to use the number 4 because it's already agreeing. You get the point? Ganon. Okay. So, you solve that. 50 revolutions per minute. You convert me into a revolution per second because hertz are revolution per second. It is not per minute. Okay. If we have 150 revolution divided by 300 kilometers. siya. Anong nabit Para makayo. So, ano yun? 150 divided by 30. Yung mga palangka. Ang mitad. Okay. 150 divided by 300. Uy, hindi. Ano ba? Ako na ba? 300 ba siya? Okay. So, 0.5 siya. Muli yung inyong frequency. 0.5. Okay. Revolution per second. You will review also. It's really 0.5. Ano na ba yun? Siya na lang. Okay. So, 30. Ganun ba nun? Divided by uh, 300. Ano na ba yun? Okay. So, revolution per minute. Mukha na siya. Okay. Revolution per minute, i-convert na ni mo o per second. Okay? Mukha na siya 0.5. Okay? Daog. No. Daog na yun. Okay? Nagpaloka. Okay? So, okay. Revolution per second. Daog na siya, guys. O, anak yun siya. So, 0.5 yung frequency. Revolution per second. Mukha na siyang balibon. Mukha na yung T. Okay, muna yung sasip-sip-sip dari Ari. Oh. Okay, dari o. Oh. Ana. Okay, so makuha din yung displacement. Okay, huwag mo siya nag-involve yung acceleration. Dali naman siya. Okay, 
So, pila mali mong reverse sa frequency. So, this is 1 divided by 0.5 na dito. So, yun. Okay? 1 divided by 0.5. Is equal to 2. O, oh, ano ba yun? 2. Okay. This is 2 seconds per revolution. This one here. And your initial angular velocity is 0. Okay? You don't have to worry. And then your final velocity, of course, this one is speeds at 30. Muna din siya niya katong angular velocity ni mo na nakuha ng 3.14. Okay, ano na yun? Okay, so, ano pa? So, 3.14 divided by 2 is equals 2 times 2. Okay, ano na yun? 3.14. So, nalaki 3.14. Okay? Ano na yung hindi? Okay, ganun siya mong good. T, capital T, mag-good na siya din na nga ang small t. Okay, ano sa mga nalika na? 3.14 divided by 2 is equals to times 300 is equals to. Okay, ganon. So, di may siya equal. If not equal, ayaw kung sa. Okay, again, review. Okay, so T to, you know, 3.14. Okay, divided by 2. Ganon, ganon, chuba-chucho. Okay, times 2. 3.14 is not equal to here. Okay? So, what you're trying to say here, because that is radian. Okay? Ganon. Revolution second. Okay? Radian, revolution second, and it turns to revolution. Magkuha pa ka na o tupay. Diba? Kasi sa pagsa kong dinimo, radian, okay, ano, radian per second. Radian per second, diba, diba ito? So, radian per second, and then two seconds per radian. Okay? Ganon. Ano na ito o? Para madali. Okay? Papasa nyo na ako guys ha. Okay? Nung natin yung 0.5 no? Atong frequency, una na siya. Okay? Frequency 0.5. Second revolution. Okay? Ganun. Pero kung ano naman itong ginar, kung ano, English displacement pa itong ginapuha na riyari no? Kung ano sa triangular displacement, so atong atong ibalikin? Char. Like this. 9.42 radian. Kani siya ito nang improve. Bakit nagpapit mo muna sa ang angular displacement? Good. Masangok ta. O, ito na po ay ganon. Okay? Kakalo. Okay. So, we use this kanisha. Try this one na. Mga palang ka. Kanita kayo. Huwag ba ito yung acceleration? Kaya nakatulog. Okay, so. Angular displays na. Butang nga niyo. We should put units so that di bulugo. Okay? 3.14 radian second. And then, yung mga tanga T. So, second revolution. Ito siya na? Second revolution. Okay. Second, second. Right? Nakansel siya. So, radian. Napatay revolution. See? Napatay revolution. Multiply na kung ano na ito siya. Sarili na yung revolution. Pila na ito yung revolution ng kwarto na nila. 150 ba ya? Okay. So, 150 revolution. Para mahimog yun siya ng radian. Kaya ang ilang 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 Please, and three times na siya. Okay? Ganon! So, one divided by point five. Okay, ganon lang siya. Two, two, two. Two. Two na na siya. Reali na ka lang na kong hitad. O. Ano ba yun? So, be sure ha, kanin, ang gila respect, pahiwaan yun yung four to ha, dikilish, if it never equal the problem. Wrong. Okay? So, three point fourteen divided by two, ganon lang siya, two, two. Times two is plus two, ganon. Times 150. Okay. It's close to. Okay. It's only half. Are you sure it's only half? So it's not good. Okay. This is not correct. Okay. So I get 0.5. So this is not correct. 2 times 0.5 is close to times 150. Okay. Did you check the other guys? If you use this one, Angular displacement is supposed to be angular velocity times time. Siya kung parihaan. Okay? So, atong i-prove mga palangga kung kita. Okay, so, 3.14 times 300 by 100 seconds. Uyak. 300. Ganan. So, kanil siya. 3.14 divided by 2 is equal to times 2 is equal to times revolution of 150. Revolution, yes, nakuha na lang po, revolution. So, 471 lang siya, yung angular displacement. So, this is gonna be, cancel, cancel, we have the radian. So, explain why this is not equal 471 radian. Okay, now, 
and then going back. So, if that is not equal, mga palang, that one metal, maybe there's something wrong with the quantity we use. Okay? Here, we're using the capital P. Okay? In this, in this approach. Okay? So, we will try to use the time period. So, we need to say, we will use the 300 seconds. There are two options. We will use the capital T in terms of revolution per and we'll also write to use the time, the normal shana time. Okay, because, you know, it's gonna be like this, option. Why? Because they are not equal. It's things like that, it's common sense, okay? We need to have to equal the option. If it is equal by using the 300 option, then that means that the T here is not really the capital T, it's the small T, it's, it's okay. Ganon? Yeah, okay? So because this one will like standard also for T. So maybe this T here also, on the spot kasi guys, okay, maybe this T kasi dito, ang capital T, di rin siya ang capital T, good, ang ordinary lang siya na time. Even though angular siya, motion, okay? Because to be honest with you, this is the first time I saw na na siya yung time ba, na angular displacement ang ipangita, okay? So, option doon man man ang kate guys, ang time period at ang time ordinary. Ang time period is the reverse with the frequency, and the time ordinary kan dito mo balinghon time ra gyud siya ba okay get the point so ana siya atong sa tong ang problem what is the angular displacement of the wheel during this time period uh, okay so ana ra so this is second option angular displacement is equals to 1 half times 3.14 radian per second okay times okay take note times 300 seconds. Okay. 3 yes, seconds. Kasi ang seconds. Sa pila na siya. We should make equal siya sa 942. Okay. If not equal, then yung buta. Okay. So, 3.14 divided by 2 is equal to times, okay, 300. And then that is already evolution. No, that is radian na siya. Okay. Is equal to the non. So, we have, yeah, that's correct. Okay, we have 471. siya sa time ng gamito na T o time ng gamito na gamay, we have 471. Okay, ano na yun? We have the same option, yield the same answer. Okay, ganon. Common sense. Maybe this is the correct one, not this one. So if it is the case, you need another backup equation. Which among them that will have the, the same answer? Okay? Because we are not really sure. There's so many formula of angular displacement. Kasi A. Okay, so we need to, to troubleshoot what's the best. No. We will use the other one. This one. Two angular solution. Okay, we will use the other one. Maram tani mo sana. Ato yung gamitin mo sa nga sayo. Maram yung anong gayun na. Okay, ganun. Okay, so here, magmeet the angular acceleration. Okay, in here, in this problem, angular acceleration ang kinangalan riyari. So, asa man na niyo mga kuha na siya. Okay, so ano na yun? Okay, angular acceleration is because of the acceleration over the radius na makai radius. Okay, ganon. So, acceleration, ano na niyo mga kuha sa V over time. Sa to pa, magkuha ka tangential. Okay? Ito the point. Magkuha kang tangential velocity. Para makakuha kang tangential acceleration. Para makakuha kang <laughs> angular acceleration. Ito the point. Ana. Okay? So, uh, tangential velocity okay, is equal to the uh, angular velocity ng 3.14 radian per second. Okay? And then, you'll multiply that with the radian. Gusto mo na siya formula. Uh, R. Capital R. One meter is the diameter, but R is 0.5 lang siya mga palaka kung hitan. Right? Diameter mo na. Radius R na. R na. Okay? Ganon. Okay. So, 0.5 times 3.14 is equals to, ang atong velocity is 1.57. Okay? Ano natin yung tangential na 1.57? Ang kanil siyang tangential na 1.57, yung ibot ang dari-ari, then, muna niyong gamit yung dari-ari sa iyong pagkuha sa iyong Acceleration, nang acceleration, nang chuchu chuchu. 
Okay? So, masama naman siya kung uh, paghitabo na rin kayo na. So, 1.5 divided by ang time mo nga second. Pila mo siya. So, 300 seconds. Ngunit mo yung itang dali-ari sa acceleration. Or kung halimbang ang angular acceleration, A over R. Yung ibutang dali-ari para makuha niyo mga angular displacement. Okay? Sorry guys, what's your space, no? Okay, ako sa nag i pa na. Okay? Sagasa lang kung suwat pa sa kay Kilid, or ganun, or whatever. Okay? Anak na siya, guys. Okay? So, anak siya. Anak na, ano? Di ba nagdami ko? Uh, angular velocity raised to the power 2 is equal to final. Angular initial velocity raised to the power 2. Then plus, this gonna be 2 acceleration times displacement. Okay, this one. Okay? Get the point. Now, To get this, what we acceleration? Because angular acceleration, that's important. Angular acceleration from tangential acceleration. Tangential acceleration is angular acceleration times the r. Then I can say this one a divided by r. We have the r. Can it be? Okay. But I doubt the r there is the uh, the r there is a range. Ato pa na siya i-prove Because you know, this is the first time I solve like this equation Normally this is, this is a wheel <laughs> Na siya yung naing yung situation Okay, so ganun siya So, natay R, batay A Balik mo na sa A, acceleration Acceleration is close to the velocity over time Ang ganun Na makuha na niyo siya, kaya naman tayo Tangential velocity, katong add to siya makuha sa Tangential velocity is the angular velocity times the R Pila, 3.14, yan, atong R na ang yung tayo, 1. Yan, 1 letter. So, anak na yun. 3.14, may gapon siya mga palang kapong hitan. Okay, letter per second. Muna na ta. I-substitute na yung balik dali. So, 3.14, letter per second, din ang mga kay tayo na lang higa yun na, nga, kuan. Kanyo, 5 minutes. So, 5 minutes pa, mara siya, 300 seconds. 300 seconds na yun. O, cancel, cancel, chuba, chuba, chuba. Okay. No, it's not cancelled. Meta per second squared na yun. Okay. So, 3.14 divided by 300. Mara siya. Okay. 300. 3.14 divided by 300. Okay. Nana siya ay 0.010. 0.0104. So, 0.0104 meter squared. So, this is going to be the acceleration. You will try to substitute that here. Okay. Ganon. So, divided naman siya, kung ano naman ang acceleration, divided naman sa radian na 1 meter. So, we have also, okay, 1 naman gano'n ng kuwan mo. Pariho rin siya, ang imong angular acceleration o ang tangential acceleration is just the same because your r is just 1 meter. Okay, so, we have 0.0104 meter per second squared. So, naka. So, solve for this one o, in this equation. So, ang initial angular velocity is 0. Right? Yan naman kay angular final velocity nga 3.14. Oh, so, ano na yan? 3.14 raised to the power 2. Mga palang ang hitad. Okay, then plus 2 angular acceleration. That is, you already know. See? Times 0.0104 times the angular displacement. Na yun. Ano na yun? O, di ba? So, kanil siya raised to the power 2 and divide this thing. Okay, how much? Ganaan. Okay, so 2 times 0.0104 is equals to 8.028. Mano yung denominator. Okay, 0.0208. Ang imong numerator ka ni siya, oh. Okay. Magbulak po ni siya because ang gamay ang mabos. Okay, so 3.14 squared is equals to divided by 0.0208 equals to 474 ang angular displacement. So very close to the other one. Kung gamitan na itong luha ka equation na linear, sumuli siya ang sakto, guys. 400, dili ang 942. Okay? So, 471 or 474k. Tulog ka equations itong gigamit sa the same angular displacement. It's just the same answer. Okay? 471 or that is really related, right? So, radian. So, katong anak siya, angular displacement, Angular velocity times time. Dili ni siya mao. Okay? You get the point. Dili pa na siya mao. Na-adjun siya ay kanigit siya ang itong gamiton. Kanigit siya o. Kanigit siya ay acceleration. Okay? Ganon. You get the point. 
Kaya di pa siya mo equal. May yung kumasag 9, 4, 2, ang 300 by amin siya niya, 2, 5. Okay? Ganon. Pero di rin siya ikan ang 3, 14, guys, ha? Okay. You get the point? Kaya naman to, 2, 5, radian. Okay, then, seconds times, katong yung revolution na po, ano, 30? So, 30, o, oh, revolution na yan. Oh. Per minute. Ano siya, no? Okay, so, it's gonna be seconds sa 300. Ano, ano siya? E, ganon. Okay, per minute. Okay, 30 divided by 300. Ano siya? Okay, so, muna siya ang may tabo. Okay, so, kay minute pa man siya, i-convert mo na din mo siya sa seconds, muna yung tabo. Okay, one minute, is 300 seconds ba yan mga palangga ko? Okay? <laughs> really, yes. Atong may review siya, guys, ganun ni ma-equal. Muna siya ang atong controversy na nita po doon kayo na. Okay, one minute is equal to 60 uh, seconds. Cancel, cancel. And then, how many seconds is that? We have uh, five minutes is 300 seconds. Okay? Ganun. Okay. Okay, cancel, cancel siya. 300 siya, blah, 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 so and so. Okay, ganun. So, 300, 300 times uh, 30. Okay? Ganun. Ako, ano nga papasong para di siya mulubog. Basta 400 na gina siya, nato tinag for ito atong i-tara if it is really correct or not. Ganun. Okay? Tanawin ito answer the rate later. <laughs> ako, naman ako sulbag. O, man ako gina siya sulbag. Good na akong i-prepare. So, on the spot man siya, guys. That's why. Okay, so you're gonna be like, uh, okay, uh, angular displacement is because angular um, velocity times time on, oh, diba? So, we have 2 pi radian over seconds. And now, uh, we have the frequency. Okay? Nakakaluka. Ang time na to is 300. Okay? 300. Okay? 300 seconds. And now, we have the frequency na atong ikot compute kanin on 30 revolution per minute and then ganon so pila man ang imong minute ang higay na okay 1 minute 60 seconds right cancel cancel so it's gonna be 30 divided by 60 right 60 man siya ba so 30 divided by right okay 60 seconds divided by 60 ganon revolution per second arrange your revolution cancel 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 Oh, ganun. So, kasi 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 ganun. So, 30 divided by 60 is just one half, right? 30 divided by 60 is just one half by looking. And I don't know, cancel mo ang zero, nanti, huwag mo ako na siya, one half na siya dito. So, pero uh, i-prove lang na ito sa calculator. Yes, one half. 0.5. Ay, nako. Parihura. 3.1416 times 2 is equals to times 300 is equals to 942 gig siya ang space ng kanina formula. Okay? Like that. Atong tanaw ng answer dito, guys, yung sigma on bilis siya. <laughs> Di ba doon naman atong choices? Okay? Radian. Ganon! Okay. Now, the other part. How far does the car travels in 5 minutes? So, kanis siya, okay, kanis siya, 5 na nun kay time na 5 minutes. So, I think this is now an economy siya. Okay? You get the point. So, 5 minutes is 100 seconds. Oh, 300 seconds. Okay. And then we have the 3.14. Oh, ganun. So, it times in any motion, 3.14. So, uh, 300 times 3.14 is equals to 942. Okay. What is that? 942 radian. Okay. Really? Yeah. Hmm. So, nakuha na nimo. Ang kanin pa lang, kanin pa lang siyang, ang ilang displacement kanin siya is the total. Okay? But the other one is based on the kinematic linear motion. Okay, makuha ang gyan ko na yung motion guys. Kanin siya yung substitute Okay? So, tanaw na to. Ang answer ha. Okay? Okay. Basing na si Kiyat Rataani. Chart! Saan mo ito? Kung makuhaan. Okay. Answers. Okay. Ang kanin compare guys. Ito nga. Duda di ko hawa for ta. Itaas gila. Diba? Okay. Ganon. Um, Saan mo na siya? Angular displacement. Okay. Ganon. Ganon. Diba? Okay. I love the question. Hindi ni siya. Okay. Bula pa po ang ito ha. Ako na ganyan ganyan guys. How far? Hindi ni siya. Understood to be displacement. Distance na ganyan guys. Sorry. 
the distance is equal to the angular displacement, sorry, okay, and the radian. Kung lang tayo angular displacement ka, 417, no, 471, yung pila man yung imong kuan, ang imong R, di ba, na kay 1. Oh, distance is equal to 472. It's just the same, magiging kami, magiging magulo, what, magulo? Ay, nakakalma mo ka. Ano yung R ba? Kanyo? Kung pariho ka siya kay 1, magulo siya. Okay? So, 471 ang answer. Mamali siya ang po ang distance na dili siya angular. O, di ba? Ang tuwag sa SS question. Okay. Ano to ang atong answer? Mga pala na kumitan. Okay? Ang answer is... Okay? Akong million na... Okay, that's correct. 471. Ang angular displacement triari. Okay? Then, kanil siya mo... 942. Okay, how far man? Okay? You get the point? How far man? Kung ano yun siya? Kapag totality niya sa inyong distance. Okay? Ganun. Okay? Imagine this one. We use three formulas and equations but yield the same answer. There's no doubt it will not become perfect. This one. Angular displacement. Bisa pun saya akan gambar itu. Different kinds of formulas and equations will yield the same answer. It's impossible that the answer is got wrong. It is got correct. In which correct? I see in the paper. Okay, like that. Okay, gana. Any question so far? No more question. No more angular acceleration. No, nah, nothing. Okay. Ada lagi siapa? Angular displacement lagi siapa? Okay, gana. Okay, ada yang apa lagi? Gak. Penghitat. Okay, klaro kayo siya. Okay? So, ganun lang. Hindi ko siya so far. I think, thank you so much for watching this live streaming. And I hope you will share this to anybody else. And you can subscribe to my channel if you're not subscribing yet. And you can click the bell notification for some of these updates of MSC. You're general voice. Bye-bye. God bless everybody. O di ba kayo gutom ko mukha on kung kuan? Buwan. Wow. Buwan, Jun. In fairness. Joke. 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 Joke.